Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode in my Unity Open World series. So in this episode, this is what I am going to work on. I am going to work on this uh, moving in cover animations. Like this. So those are the things I am going to cover today. And this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons. Thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me. Okay, now in the current implementation, we can go like this and take cover, but we haven't worked on movements yet. So, how do we implement the movements? Alright. Mm. Let's open the character moment script. Actually, we need all the scripts open. Okay. So, this one, uh, this is the script that rotates, I think uh, that rotates the character towards the movement direction first I need to disable that so here I'll add a new variable public pool orient let's start with the simple orient uh, let's call it to move mat uh, let's for the as the default value let's keep true right and I'll do this orient part only if this is true otherwise I won't do that right now when we are when we enter the cover here I'll set character character movement orient to movement I'll set it to false like this now let's see what happens Okay, still this is not working, but the character is not rotating anymore. Right, now we need to fix that. So, in that, if I do it like, if I am not orienting the character to the moment, then I should calculate the side speed values and apply them to the animator here as for this velocity so that means this velocity should have minus values as well so how to calculate it then in the character moment oh, that should be happening in character animation controller Yeah, here, like this. 
so now I should be setting this speed let's see how do I get this on like this so this actually returns a for uh, returns a float value I need another function that returns a the vector value hmm. okay uh, let's see right uh, so I even though maybe I am breaking some principles but defining another function in the character itself to get velocity kind of feels like uh, unnecessary so therefore let's do it like this character dot moment character moment and then velocity let's save this to uh, vector 3 the error ah oh. ah oh, sorry this should be vec to 3 right now okay now I should set the speed like this only if character uh, moment orient to moment if that is true I should set the speed like this and otherwise I should set the speed so I need to calculate the speed now so here we only need the side component of the velocity so how to get the side component right like this speed equals to vector 3 dot product sorry dot dot product dot product of uh, character character moment velocity and uh, the animator components the mesh components a right vector that means uh, I don't have a reference to mesh comp uh, uh, character mesh components transform here but I have a reference to animator so animator transform dot uh, right vector and then just like before we have to set the speed let's see what happens right actually we get the 
correct values but it sees the direction is mixed up and also there is some some jerk in effect as well all right let's fix it how oh, let's set it like this this is the new value this is to prevent the jerk in effect the new value is this I'll add a comment here side velocity and then yeah I saw that my directions are interchanged so I think I have to change these animations this one is for the plus one the sneak and right I have applied it for the plus one I should apply it for the minus one and this neglect to plus one right now let's see yeah now it's correct So my next goal is uh, when I how to identify the limit of this cover that means when I am here if I am no longer in the cover I should exit the cover mode like this. So I'll do that in the next episode. So if you would like to support my work, you can get the membership of my Patreon club. The link would be in the description below. And thanks for watching. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.